Well, hello everyone. Welcome. We are back with some more Demon Souls. We had quite a bit of progress last time. I think we took down like four bosses. So I think we have things ready to fight some more. I think I have all the stuff I need for this boss. I might want more grass, but I'm sure I'll be fine. Wouldn't be that bad, right? Um, and then I think that's all. So let's go and take on the next boss. Ugh. Well, there's a moon. How have I not noticed that this whole time? Interesting. I'll just run past this guy. It's just gonna get confused anyway. I have a sneak ring on. We have a new way to fight these things. Take down two hits. He dropped something. Never mind, he didn't. That's right, you perish. Okay. Well, let's keep moving. That's gonna be tricky trying to go up these stairs, I think, because they got another one of those bell squid guys. So, we're gonna have to be careful not to let them hit us, otherwise we'll die. I'm sure we can do it. Couldn't possibly be that hard. I just gotta be careful and not go too high. So that way I can try to sneak up behind him or something. Okay, there he is. Let us cloak ourselves. How? How did he know? How? Well, that's unfortunate. Okay. I didn't think he was going to be able to see me since I was invisible. But oh, how I was wrong. Well, now that I took him out, I don't need to worry about the Thieves' Ring for now. Oops. So, let us regenerate our health. I'm gonna be a little cheaty with this boss, because there's two of them, and I don't like them ganging up on me. There's an item over here. So, if they want to gang up on me, then I'll just be smart and take them down one at a time. Let's see, I think there's more items this way. If not, it'll be a waste to even have an area over here. Just exploring for nothing at that point. Yeah, there is an item over here. I knew it. Not a very good item, but nevertheless, still an item. And good timing too, because we just got our health restored. Let me change it to magic quick. And hopefully it won't take too long. And the magic one goes way slower than the, heat, the health one, I think. 
Yeah, it's whatever, it's fine. Let's change this back to our thieves ring. And we are gonna wanna hide ourselves and enter. And somehow he knew where I was. Get this item here. Okay. Poison cloud out. Okay. So he's gonna be right there, so we'll just poison him a bunch. Uh oh. I think I messed up. Is it getting him? Oh, yep, there it goes. And then... We will do this. Okay. Now we hide again. Because we don't want to die. That Dumbo just flying back into place. Okay. Now, if I walk on them again, and that didn't work. Um, do I have anything I can throw at him? This is the next question. Yep. Okay. Now there's a second one, and that's very scary. Of course they're both right there though. This is unlucky. We can poison him though. That's probably going to be the plan of attack is just to keep poisoning them. Guy up there's a problem. Okay. What is he doing? Well, he's stuck running in a wall. Oh, I don't think that works. I'm out of magic. Let us use an item then. Let's see this one. Poison them both. Or at least we're gonna try. Um I kind of want to do something risky here, and... Oh boy. Ooh. Back over there again, but he knows I'm here. Or does he? This is very stressful. see the one up there. Let me get my magic back again. Why is it not working? Oh boy. Oh 
Oh boy. Not good. Not good. Oh boy. Oh no. I died. I knew it was risky. That's why I don't like these guys. There's two of them. They get stuck like that. They're uh, kind of a pain in the butt to deal with. Uh, we did fairly good though. guy up there. Guy behind me is not there, so that's good. Now we gotta go all the way back up. I'm sorry if the boss takes a long time. I think we're just gonna have to keep poisoning him. And then... Hiding in our spot until the poison wears off. At least that's what I think I need to do. Okay, where is the guy up here? I need to know where he stops while going back down the stairs. That'll help me the most. I got the thieves ring. Okay, there he goes. Okay, I got him. Ooh. You know what? We can replace this with some magic ones. And replace this with the knife. Just in case I need it. That way we will be prepared for the battle. This time, I need to stick to the plan, so that way I can defeat them. Arguably, it might be easier to do this boss if I did it online, because then it would be against another player. Uh, but these man-eater things are fairly simple. You can kind of cheat it. Okay, I hid. Oh, he got away too fast. I was hoping I was gonna get him with it. Why didn't he get poisoned? There we go. I see, I gotta aim for the tail if I wanna poison them. So that means I can't cut their tails off right away. Poison's pretty slow. But it's taking off quite a bit of the HP pretty quickly. Wonder if the um, HP got changed or something in this game. Seems like it's going down a lot faster. I got grasses and stuff. Probably want to have the maximum healing grass equipped at the very start. 
What did I come with? Evacuate, heal, poison cloud, and cloak. Okay. Well, ideally, we should just have to do the poison, so... Here comes the second one. Wherever it is. Who knows? I don't hear it or see the second one. Oh, it's up there. That is a little lucky. If it stays up there for a while. It'll also be really bad if he doesn't come down, so... Might be a blessing, might be a curse if he's up there like that. That means I'll have to bait him down later and... I'll have to run from him. Which could prove deadly, so... Yeah. This boss can be cheesed pretty easily, so... That's something. But I don't mind. As soon as I get one of them out of the way, I don't mind trying to fight the other one. But I might be cautious just in case. Because I do have two annoying attacks that I'm not very good at dodging. Surprise how much damage one poison cloud will do. It's almost at a thousand. Oh, does 900 damage, huh? Oh, there's a second one. Nice, they're both poisoned. That's good for me. Although now one's stuck running into the other one. <laughs> I just realized my sword is not looking very good on durability. Might as well do this while we're waiting. Okay. I'm gonna think, I wonder, is there any kind of stories I can tell you while we wait? Let me check my story list. Yes, I do keep a story list. Ooh, I just remembered a good one. So, uh... Has anyone else, as like a kid in school, ever noticed how like the bathrooms would have like the styrofoam square ceiling, depending on the school? Well, I had a very clever idea as a kid, and I used to stash a bunch of food in the ceiling. <laughs> and uh, I would literally just hop up on like the wall thing and push up that ceiling tile, hide a bunch of Cheetos or something up there. It was a grand old time. I know it probably sounds weird though, because I was a very adventurous kid. I did a lot of strange things. That and, uh, I remember in school one time I was in like a history class and I was there drawing in my art book because I didn't really care about the class at the time. And uh, I think they were going doing like vocabulary or something. And uh, the teacher came to me and was like, hey, you shouldn't be drawing. It's time to learn. I was like, I already know it all. And he's like, okay, well then I'll ask you one. And he said like two words and I blurted out the answer. I was kind of surprised I got it right. But <laughs> after that, he didn't say anything about me drawing in my book. <laughs> I always thought that was a pretty funny uh, experience to uh, be able to kind of own the teacher like that. Although, I don't know if I would do that today. I'd probably just be polite and maybe 
tried to put the book away or get a smaller book so it's not as distracting to draw in. And these guys are doing so good on damage. Wait for the second one. Okay. this. See if that, yep, it gets both of them. Okay. Back to the story time corner, I guess. Let me think, uh, what other experiences have I had? Uh... Oh yeah, has any, anyone ever like seen like those Boy ad commercials as a kid and they'd see like the number and everything has anyone ever called those places as a kid because I always did I would see it I would call those poor people and be like yes I would like to order one RC helicopter please and they'd be like oh yeah should can you put your parents on the line for this I'd be like I am the father <laughs> and then that would be usually be the part where they're like okay well can you give us like a payment card and that's whenever I hung up the phone. <laughs> I never usually got very far with those uh, adventures of calling those toy companies. It was pretty funny though. Cause uh, I can't believe they played along with me and said, well, you're the father? Okay, give us the payment method. <laughs> but uh, I guess that's just kind of how it, I guess that's just kind of how it happens. Uh, I remember when I was a kid, uh, my family used to go out camping in this one place, and there's like a house in the middle of like an empty field, like literally no roads, anything, just an empty field. And I used to sleep on the porch with my cousin, and I don't know what show it was. There used to be like this farmer show. I think it was like uh, like the Redneck Farm Show or something. It had like these two farmers. They were comedians. They're pretty funny. But, uh, I remember staying up on the porch at night watching those kind of shows with my cousin. Kind of miss those days, because, uh, that cousin had, like, a lot of bad stuff happen, so I haven't seen him in quite a while. Hmm. Whatever. What else could I think of? Well, I guess adding on to that story, uh, I know a lot of other people out there probably never had the country farm life like me but uh I know some people have asked me before like living in the country do you guys really not lock your doors or anything and the answer is we don't there's not really anyone who comes around who would want to steal from us so we'd always have the doors unlocked it's just pretty convenient although nowadays you gotta be more careful with that kind of stuff Ooh, one of them died Let us poison this other one. Okay. Poison successfully. But yeah, like, we just don't lock our doors. That in farmers, we just have a... Uh, you ever drive on, like, a gravel road and you see a guy wave at you and you don't know him? Don't freak out, it's a normal thing. It's the farmer wave. We're just super friendly and uh, just kind of do that. We wave at people, it's a nice greeting. That and um, I wonder what else is there to think of? Um, I just remembered, I really miss the book fairs from school and stuff with like Scholastic and everything. You used to have like those Lego encyclopedia books and whatnot that have like the Lego minifigures you could collect. I remember I used to almost get every single one of those things. I'm, I wonder if I can still buy stuff like that. I assume they'd probably have it through a website or something. But uh, yeah, they used to have like a lot of good books like uh, Bone by Jeff Smith and uh, Conspiracy 365 was my favorite book series when I was in middle school. It was 
such a good series. I think I should buy that whole collection and just reread it. Like, great book about like a kid on a, the run for a year. So, <clears throat> this guy's getting pretty close to dying. But, uh, hey, now it's uh, the new year. I don't know if I mentioned that. It's 2024 now, January 2nd. So that's exciting. All sorts of uh, new things to try to plan and do this year. I'm just glad to be done with 2023. That has to have been the most depressing year of my entire life. I had the most mental breakdowns, most depression. I'm ready to start a new year and be positive again. And things are looking up for me. I made some new friends. They're pretty great. So I can't wait. Okay, let's see. I wonder, can I sneak up on him and just kill him? There we go. Ooh. That made that easier. With that, I think our story time is going to have to close, because we can finally do stuff now. Don't worry, eventually I have plenty of stories to tell. So whenever I'm playing games like these, if I'm stuck in like a really repetitive part, or I gotta wait, you can count on me to give you some good stories. Let's see, what do we got here? It didn't... Oh, there we go. Souls, nice. Well, let's head back to the Nexus. Okay, here we are. Hello, maiden lady. I would like to upgrade, please. If I did health, I could even that out. Hmm. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. I think I did strength so last time. That and I upgraded faith so I could get that second slot. Should upgrade magic at some point to get another slot for magic. Um, let's do our health, so that way we can survive. Art, may thy strength. And then, what else should I do? I think I need materials for the one sword. I haven't found the right soul yet, so I'm wondering if I've been to the right places or not. Who knows? <gasps> Um. Hmm. Hey, it's Mister. Your souls. Well, let's repair our equipment. And then. That's right. I couldn't upgrade my Kilogy anymore. What about the steel shield? Nope. Okay. You come back alive. So, I think... I'm having a hunch that it, the one I'm looking for might be in this area. Let's look around and see if we can find the one I need. Or at the very least, we should at least get the bridge in this area so I can skip the hard part. That way, it'll be easier to get to the boss. Clump, 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 clump. Sounds so heavy with all my armor. Hello. Let's see, what rings do I have on? 
I don't need the cling ring. I do want poison resistance. Because that's what the swamp does, if I recall correctly. Are the two guys that were down here. Oh, they're over here. I see. Huh. That's interesting. Let's hurry over here. And we're gonna have to be careful. Okay. So I have a plan. We need to go this way. Now if we're going this way, might as well get the item. I'm gonna get poisoned from the water no matter what, so... We need to be sneaky up here. Get some magic. Make ourselves quiet. So we can try to sneak around the people over here. Might have gotten the water a little too soon. This item. See, I need to hide again. Because I don't want to be caught by this guy up here. Yeah, we made it through. Nice. Exactly what I wanted. Now we're gonna have the stupid mosquitoes and stuff up here. Ow. Oh, that's annoying. Okay. Got it. Yeah, those mosquitoes can be pretty annoying. Ow. Not good to see. Get off me. I hate those mosquitoes, they're so dumb. Okay. Ow. That piece of shit. Oh no. Now I gotta do all that again. Oh, that's annoying. I have reduced health now, too. I say it might as well get rid of the poison ring. It doesn't help much. Let's make our way back down. Why? Oh, no. I was gonna say, why am I missing health? But I forgot. I, uh. I forgot the reason why I was missing health. There we go. There's an item over there. Let me go this way, though. Be great if the swamp area here uh, didn't poison you. 
But I understand why it does. I gotta try to sneak around the big brood up there again. Okay. Hide myself. I really don't want to set that guy off. Once I get to this side, I'll just drop in the water. It's not going to matter too much. I'm already poisoned. Let's see what do we got here? Thieves ring. Okay. over here dark moon grass okay okay now comes one of the tricky parts I gotta make it up there without being seen by more of the big brutes then I gotta run through everything and hope I don't die And if I really wanted to, I'm pretty sure there's a sword that I can get to the left. Let's cast a cloak, eat some grass, and off we go. Time to hope I don't set these guys off too much. I don't think I did. Okay. So now, let's run through here and try to get to the end. And I gotta make sure I don't get caught. Oh boy, that's not good. But I'd rather be here. Okay. Paint stone. I think I need to go over here to get back up. up right here. Ow. Oof. Well, I'm alive, so that's good. I got poisoned again, gosh darn it. Might be easier to try to kill them all to get through. It's also kind of annoying to do that, so I don't really want to. I'm almost there. Ooh, I made it. Well, 
I just need to make it to the end. Oh, these stupid mosquitoes. Okay. I was worried the mosquito was going to make me fall. Can't hardly see. Okay. Yeah. Doing good so far. I'm almost there. Okay. Getting the lizard. First time I've gotten that lizard, I think. There we go. Now, no matter what happens, we'll be good. Now, I can head back. And take on the boss. Maybe we'll get lots of bosses done in this episode like we did last time. I hate those stupid mosquitoes. No. That's a bad spot to be. Let's get out of here. Do things the safe way. Okay. Now. I can get rid of Cloak. It's better than having you both. We'll put... Soul Arrow back on. Ooh, Firestorm would be good too. But I don't have the magic I would need to even use that spell, so... Okay. Before I do anything... Let me use some souls and level up. Let's use all 20 of these. That's 4,000. Okay. Getting all the souls. Quite a bit, so we should be able to level up quite a few times. Hi, Maiden. Let's see, what do I want to do? Could upgrade health and make it so my soul form has more, but. I'll do intelligence one. Endurance could be good. I'll raise my equip. Burden and my stamina. Strength really doesn't do too much. We'll do dexterity. Actually, let me check something quick. So I'm gonna have to do more than three levels of magic if I want another magic memory. So let's do this. 
Okay. I think we're ready for the fight. Surprisingly, this area has gone, like, very, very smooth while I've been trying to do it. Only, like, one or two hiccups. And usually this is, like, the hardest area. So, that's a good thing to see. Hello, oh, fire pole man. Oh, what do you have? Grass? I can always use some grass. Yeah, but now we can use this. Second time I've gotten that lizard. The faint stone is good. Can't one hit these guys. But that's fine. Keep heading up this way. Don't know how I survived that. Okay, go up. There we go. Hate when they're in the way because I can't get around them immediately. Eventually, I'll have to try to come back through all this and loot things. Stand a chance. See, the boss is this way, I think. Yep. Now, I'm pretty sure this boss isn't too hard to fight. Gotta be careful of those first. Get away, get away. Okay, go. Oof. That dagger did quite a bit of damage. Ow. I think he's dead. Ooh. That was not too bad. And I got my body back again. Which is good because I'll probably need it for the next boss fight. Got 
got here. More soul stuff. I'll get back up. There we go. So where do I need to go now? This way? Let's see. The eroded demon soul, huh? Real quick. Go back, level up, since we just got those souls from that boss. Let's see, what should I get? Drawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Dexterity so and strength will mended. both upgrade stuff. I don't see much of a difference between these two. Strength would be good. So let's do that. Now we got 12,000. Maybe I can upgrade again. Let's use this. And this. How much does a legendary do? Oh, that's quite a bit. So how much more do I need? I really need like 2,000 more. Let me... I only need 2,000. Let me just go... Actually, let me get rid of some of these extra rings quick. Put away the ones I'll never use. Then, let's go here. Oh, this guy for sure will give me a bunch of souls that I'll need. So let's get him here and call it good. If I had a place where I could sell stuff in this game, that would be good too. all I need. There we go. Hello, maiden. Let's see, if I upgrade strength again, goes up by one. I'll just do strength, so that way it's at 20. Because that should help me with other weapons. If I decide to use anything else down the line. Other than that, I think I should be good now. So, let's take this boss on. Here we go. we got here? Otis? So this will be the final boss of this area. And I think this is where I get the soul that I need for my sword. There's a lot of dead bodies. What are you doing hanging out in a place like this? Oh, 
There's her knight. Go forth, Galvin. May you be unharmed. I don't know about that. I think he's going to be very harmed when I'm done with him. I can't leave you be here. Oh no. That's bad. Really bad. Really bad. Come on. Not good. I'm gonna lose my body. Yeah. That was so unlucky. I hate those things. Why couldn't I run in the water? That was stupid. Ugh. Oh, let's get rid of the thieves ring. Let's activate our healing ring. Makes me think. Let's just heal up. And here we go. Whoops. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't know I had my wand out. See, where is the knight? There he is. Okay. I should poison him. Okay. Come at me. How the heck did he do that? Well, that was not good. Don't let him parry me, I guess. <laughs> I didn't know he could do that. Let's try again. So, need to be smart, attack, then back off, attack, then back off. Ow. Hey, take this. I'm not going to attack you first, man. I already know what you're going to do. Ow. That wasn't pleasant. Man, that doesn't do much to him. I can't poison him. Seems like my heavy attacks are doing good. This is a good spot because his hammer will keep hitting the wall. Come back this way. Okay. 
This is a tense battle. Bring it. Ow. That wasn't pleasant. Come back here. Got him. There is destroy him. Ooh. I failed you. Seems like all the hard things are happening really easily for once. I'm pretty sure if I go to her, she's just gonna off herself. Because her knight's dead. Ugh, I'm plagued. Hello. You, you killed him, didn't you? I did. Very well. Do as you like. Well, thank you. I appreciate you not putting up a struggle. Which one did I get? Pure blood. Nice. That's exactly what I needed. I'm surprised. I thought he was going to be more of a challenge. Hello. Thou seekest then touch the soul of the mind. Oh, let's see. What should we do? Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Let's just keep doing strength for now. And call it good. Arthur, may thy strength. And then What else was I gonna do? Oh yeah. I can make my sword now. excited for this. I'm pretty sure this sword will do more damage if I'm remembering correctly. Hey buddy. You wanna make me something cool? Let's make the broken sword to the blue blood sword. Perfect. Just what I wanted. Then... If I wanted, I could start leveling up the shield or something. Actually, what stats do I need? the blue blood sword doesn't tell me right away let's see here it's heavier than my current sword so that might be a problem but we will see here, let me buy some shards from you Just get 12 of these. And then let's go back. Okay. First, let me see what I need to equip it. I need strength 18 and a hand 18, magic 18, and the star 18. Here. So faith needs to be 18, magic needs to be 18, my dexterity needs to be 18, so I need a lot of stats for this thing. Oh boy. Of course I find this out 
when it's already hard enough to get stuff to level up now. Um, excuse me. Alright, let me see if... Ooh, I could level up this shield. Hmm. Let me check this first. Because ultimately this is a better shield. But I do like this shield a little better. If I go buy six more, I can upgrade this shield again. Let me do that. You come back alive. I'll buy some more of these quick. Come back, level up my shield. Then, I'm gonna need to start leveling up so I can use the sword. Oh, hello. I think I just need six of these again, right? <laughs> and we head back. Okay. I can forge weapons for you. Let's do this again. So now if I want to do this shield anymore, I'll need chunks and shards. But I don't think I'll be able to get the chunks, so I might as well not worry about it. Um, repair equipment. It's pretty cheap. Do come back alive. Okay, now... What do I have in my inventory? I have a moon short sword. Where did I get that? Great sword. I'll put this away so I'm not as heavy. Um, I don't need the long sword. Don't even have a bow, so there's no point to having that. Put these away. Might as well put the gold mask away since I can't even wear it. Um, honestly, I don't need these. Miracle power and casting time. Interesting. These are pretty much the main rings I need. These away. Make myself a lot lighter. Holy moly, this grass is 10 pounds. What the heck? Let's put a bunch of that away. Need about two of them at a time. Don't even need this. These, I can put some of them away. Then... I keep that just in case. These I can put away. myself way lighter by putting all this garbage away. Um, I think that's about it for there. Yep. So, let's see, what was I going to do now? Right. I'm going to upgrade. These. So I should be able to level up one more time now. Let's see, I need faith 18. Oh, I can't even level up yet. Whoops. 
Let strength be granted. That's good to know. I I am here for thee. Well, what should I do? I don't know. Oh, let me think here. So, I have one more boss here. I think I have one more here. And then I have all the rest, I think. No. Nope. I do. Okay. Actually, I'm curious. Excuse me. I need one of my things back. Um. I think it was in here. Here it is, Storm Ruler. We are in danger. Thank you. I can forge weapons. Just in case. Oh, I don't need Storm to repair it. Thing. Okay. Let me swap this out. Let me go in here. Wrong place. Oh, I just... I hit the button too fast. I don't want to start here. I want to start right here. Now, make it so it's easier to slay enemies. I'm pretty sure that these guys will give me a bunch of souls. Yep. Ow. Ow. Got him. They're hitting me though, so that hurts. These guys are pretty good to farm. They give me a thousand each. Not too bad. That all of them? I think it is. Uh, ooh, the crystal lizards are over there. Let me be stealthy. Escaped. Oh, what do you got? Moonshade chunk. That's good. I know the crystal lizards in this area are important, I think. But uh, who knows? See where is Maiden? There she is. Hi there. Then touch soul of the mind, key to life's ether. We'll make our faith soul go up. Lost, 
drawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted to the world. Art thou finished? I am finished. Actually, I wonder... If I go up to the Monumental, are they gonna say anything to me? That's the real question. I'm curious to know if their dialogue would change at all. I haven't really talked to them, except for the one time. I just kind of forget about the monumental. Hello. We neutralized the old one and banned the soul arts. Then we spread the archstones, and in order to mend reality, monumentals we became. See. However, man's memory of history is ever short, and before long he repeated his mistakes. The monumentals perished, and the archstones were long forgotten. And the short-sighted King Alant once again roused the old one. I see. That's not good. Have you received assistance from the Candle Maiden? I have. And that Oops. is why she has become a demon herself. I skipped past what you said by mistake. I'm sorry. A soul is the essence with which living things comprehend the world around them. When one loses the soul, one loses the mind. And a land barren of souls is absorbed by fog. And banished to the infinite darkness. I see. The old one is a bottomless pit of nothingness, with an insatiable appetite for the souls collected by its faithful demons. The old one's very nature cannot be fathomed by the living. I see. The soul arts shall be lost once the old one is lulled back to slumber. Does that mean like the, the essence of thought, upgrades I got through leveling or what? In all living things. You must never forget. The power that you now enjoy contradicts the essence of the soul, for it stems from demon magic. I mean, I guess that is a concern. Have you visited the Pantheon on the uppermost floor? What is that? The Pantheon honors the souls of demon slayers, like yourself. I see. Perhaps one day your soul too will be honored in that same fashion. That would be cool. That is the most we can do to give thanks. To the brave and honorable warriors who fight to reverse our sins. I see. Have you visited the Okay, so now you just repeat. To the brave. So apparently there's a pantheon above. I'm pretty sure when I went up here last time there was nothing but a closed gate. Yeah. Just a closed gate. I've never been able to get up here. Not in this version or the PS3 version. I assume it's got to be like a multiplayer online thing where it doesn't unlock unless you're online. Which sucks because I still want to see what's up there. There's items down there that I haven't gotten yet, huh? Interesting. I don't know if I want to try risking it for them right now.
Let's make our way back down here. And I think that's where we'll wrap it up for now because we took down a few of the bosses already. So there's only two major ones left, Boletaria and I think it's like the, the mage one up there. So next time we'll try to see if we can take those on. I'm probably going to try to upgrade so I can use the new sword that I built, but that might take a little bit, so I don't know how I'm going to do that. I might just grind for it um, off the videos and everything, so we'll see. I don't know. Maybe I can do it and we can get back to story time again. So, But with that, remember, drop down, hit that red subscribe button for me if you would. I'm trying to reach 1,000 by the end of this year, 2024. Last year, I was not able to do it, but we did get close to halfway. So, if we do reach a thousand, I think I will plan some kind of community event. Maybe we can all hang out, play games together. Maybe I'll make some special video for you guys. Who knows? But, with that, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time.